So two days ago, the church posted this article. And when someone shared it, I honestly thought it was a joke. I had to go and look it up and see for myself. So this is the article. So the story in the article is about a woman named Mary Whitmer. And when she was milking cows in the barn, she was visited by a man who shouldered the golden plates. But when I saw it, that's not where my mind went at all. My mind went to something more like this. As many of you know, Fanny Alger was 16 years old and working in Joseph Smith's home as a domestic servant. And while she was there, Joseph Smith made advances on her. One of the top Mormon leaders named Oliver Cowdery called it a dirty, nasty, filthy affair. William McClellan says that Emma Smith saw Joseph and Fanny in the barn and she saw the transaction, meaning that they had sexual relations. And Chauncey Webb, who was a blacksmith, reported that Emma drove Fanny out of the house and that Fanny was unable to conceal the consequences of her celestial relation with the prophet. And when you look at Fanny Alger on the church's website, none of these sources are quoted or mentioned at all. This, to me, feels more like an effort on the church's part to control the SEO. What do you think?